what is happening traders welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video we are going to be looking at usd jpy don't forget that if you are looking for a reliable broker to make sure to sign up to my broker using the link that is in the description below and get yourself a trading bonus of 140 us dollars to actually start trading with so without wasting any time let us get on with it so basically when i'm actually looking at usd jpy, USD -JPY I'm seeing that it's been very very bullish right it's been very very bu bullish like from the beginning of the month it's been just insanely going up right so you might um want to actually uh sort of like benefit benefit from this trend like if you if you weren't able to probably enter there then probably now it's your time to probably enter here right but let's see um what 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 might happen there right let's look deep into this pair right so um this pair has actually been respecting its higher lows and higher highs that is also what you need to actually take note of right so it's been a bullish pair and it's actually been respecting its higher lows and higher highs right so that is actually what you actually have to take a look at and as you can see that if we can go over to our daily time frame price has just been insanely bullish for the past week or for, for, for the past two weeks right excuse me so that is actually what you have to take note of so what is happening right now what i'm seeing right now if you can just simply go over to our one hour time frame basically i'm seeing price coming i'm seeing price coming to that support right there right and i'm also seeing price coming to my flip zone right today all right so price is actually coming to my support and price is actually coming to my flip zone right there as you, as you can see and if we can just simply go over to our four hour time frame we can see that price is actually giving us a week right can see that on the one hour time frame it actually gave us full bodied kanglis kanglis when it was actually going to the downward but right now it's, it's just giving us a week that is why i always say to you guys that normalize using higher time frames because they actually get to tell you what is really really happening especially if you're wanting to trade breakouts normalize using higher time frames right so basically um this pair actually might just um continue you know creating a, a series of high highs and high lows and all of those things and you know it might actually just you know go upward or if you can look at something strange that it, that has actually happened here is this pair has just started to print a series of lower lows and lower highs right so you have to be mindful of price once it actually reaches that level right there if you're already in um please be mindful of, of 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 price when like it actually reaches that level right there take partial profits and then put your stop loss at break even because price might do that and then proceed just crushing the whole trend and you know sort of like um crushing the whole trend why why am i saying this is possible i'm saying this is possible because if we can go over to our excuse me if we can go over to our daily or weekly time frame you can see that price is at a strong level here right you can see that price is actually at a strong level so it having to give you a series of lower lows and lower highs might indicate something too you feel me so that is what you also have to take note of take partial profits or you know also be mindful of this area when price actually gets there right uh, another thing that you have to take note of is um look at what price has been doing here man remember price repeats itself look at what price has been doing there just look at what it's been doing there sorry about that just look at what price has been actually doing there it's been printing out a series of w's it's been printing out a series of double bottoms so it might be also wise for you to actually wait for a what 
for maybe a double bottom before you even anticipate on entering on this pay right because price has been reversing using a series of double bottoms or using a series of um of of, of the of w's right so that's also what you have to take note of otherwise just be on the lookout for this pair because you know it might do something crazy you know it's it's been super super bullish in fact i think all all all, all um all jpy pairs have been just acting all crazy like have been just acting all crazy but um you know if you've already entered or if you actually get your 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 your, your entry properties make sure that you actually look out for this error there right make sure you actually look out for this error there because price might just come back at it and then just destroy everything right so when price actually gets there try to actually protect your profit remember i said that you mustn't just put your stop loss at break even because price has just hit 20 pips profit no no this is one of the reasons why you must put your stop loss at break even because price is actually at at an opposing level then what what would you have to do obviously you've got to protect your profits right you've got to put your stop loss at break even so that is it for this video guys do make sure to grab your 140 us dollars to start trading with the link is in my description you can sign up to my broker see you in the next video